Hola amigos, hola amigas, Dorian here from Hoovalux. Welcome, bienvenido, Christ to ease, salam alaikum. This gentleman sitting here to my left, say hello. Hello. This is Chris, and Chris is a repairman. Explain to us what you do. I mend commercial laundry equipment and fridges and stuff for my job, and my channel is The Laundry Centre. Yes. Go subscribe. Please go and check out, it's called The Laundry Centre. If you like your washing machines and all those different kinds of... Um, white goods and everything please go and check out his channel it's really good and he's got an amazing amazing chematic that he is going to be restoring so Keep the reason time. why i dragged chris into this video is because of this Seabor k1 now this came up on ebay before i went to australia and it was in southampton and i was like who do i know that lives near there and i was like ha chris so I contacted Chris and I gave him the address and he said yes he'd pick it up. So then I bought it and then Chris went and picked it up and that was back in... It was a long time ago. It was, yeah, it was yeah, a, it was long a couple time of months ago, ago wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it does. So anyway, so Chris thankfully went and picked this up and it is in pretty good condition. I'll move the camera closer so we'll have a look at it. And it is this one which is the Siebel K3 and what i loved about this is because it's got the power head on it the et1 i think or maybe it's not the et1 i don't know what to say it is the eth so the brush roll that i bought for it won't work but never mind i will have to buy another one uh i'll use it on something else so what i'm going to do i'm going to bring you guys a little bit closer and we will take a look at it this is an electric power head which I will take off that you can see here now I didn't realize this has got a two-part brush roll to it type ETH and it's 150 watts inspection port wheels now this one we tried to work it out and this is uh, I believe it's to make the brush roll stick to the carpet more but it's kind of not very no, I think it works by really uh, like um, a suction thing, you know, the, um, I don't know how to explain. You know what I mean. Anyway, so that's, that's the power head. If you know, you know. Now you know if you know. This is the extension, electric power, extension, tube, very nice. And then the brush attaches to it there. Here we have the power handle with on, off, and up to maximum, all controlled by the handle. It's very much like the Mila, uh, the one that I got from Sam, uh, the S something or other. And then this is the machine itself. So attached to the top of it is a um, upholstery brush. That's the on and off button. In here, there is a filter, which I have bought a new one of. Around the back we have the cord. Now this is not a button, you just pull it out till you need it. And then pull it out and then release it for it to go in. But it's not the best. Oh, now it is, <laughs> okay. <laughs> that just proved Terrible. me wrong. <laughs> There's the socket, the power socket and the intake for the do it. And then here, which is quite unusual, the bag is on the back. Needs a bit of a clean, it's not, it's got a nice bag on it. This is type SIBO air belt K3. 1500 to 1800 watts, uh, made in Velbert in Germany. And 240 volts, blah, 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 K3. So then you put your bag in there, close it up, and that pushes the bag up to the nozzle. Spinny wheel there, not very, it's a bit scratchy. Two wheels here at the bottom. Very, very compact. Now, what I'm going to do is plug it all in. Plug it in. Now I know that Miko uh, is gonna like that one, this one. Now the other thing I've noticed as well is the grip on this to hold it 
isn't exactly very strong. It does, if you push it hard enough, it pushes down by itself. So let's put it up on its fullest height. I'll plug it in and then we'll give it a quick demo. So Chris is gonna be the guinea pig that's gonna be using it. So to turn it on, turn on the button here. Green light comes on indicating that there's power there. And then Chris, with the handle, <laughs> we need bigger room. And that is very good, very, very good. So what do you think of it, Chris? I like it. Yeah. I should have tried it before I brought it up for doing I know. <laughs> I, he said that to me when he, we tried it earlier. And I was like, oh you my gosh, you could have been yeah. using it all this time. You probably you know, would have enjoyed using it. Never mind, I'll keep I my eyes it, open. You got it, but there we go. <laughs> <laughs> it wouldn't have come back to me. No. Right, okay. What I'm going to do, I'm going to move the camera over and we'll finish off this quick video together. Okay, so we're back. We've moved the camera over. So what came with this as well is this got given to me by Rob, which is lovely, which is the combi tool. So you can use this on hard floors and also on um, carpets with this caster with this brush at the back. Well. Then we got a dedicated, no, no, this one as well is the same kind of thing. It's got a squeegee at the back, it's got the velour, and then this has got a castellated brushes. But that one's better because that one's plastic and that one's metal. Then we have got here a natural bristle by the look of it. This is a hard floor, like parquet um, dusting tool. We've got a crevice tool, which is weird that you can't keep the crevice tool on. On board. Yeah, yeah. on anywhere. Let me see. Stop it with a dusting brush. Yeah, possibly. And then this then is the mini turbo brush, which I haven't actually tried yet. It. So let's put this down. Take that off there. Try this on there. a little bit of lubrication on it uh, because it just sounds a little bit rattly but it's in really good condition yeah. it's hardly been used mm. really good very lucky very very lucky but, uh, yeah so there we go that is just a quick overview of this machine and a big thank you to Chris here from the laundry center for picking it up for me and You're also right. for bringing it up as well thank you very much You're for right. doing that it was worth waiting for definitely so there we go so, like I said, please comment, like, and subscribe for more videos. Go check out Chris's channel. I'll put a link in the video description below. I am absolutely sweating because this room is really <laughs> warm. Um, so I will see you in the next video, and it's goodbye from me and goodbye from Chris. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Bye.